Well, here she is, guys. My Bronco finally taking her out for her first run. This is 100% stock. I haven't done anything to it yet. Just open the box like the uh, short that I posted yesterday. So see what she's like. Oop. Yeah, those rear springs are definitely stiff. As you can see, they don't want to give at all. Kind of what I've seen everybody else that have driven these things talk about, but you know, we can change that. Not too shabby. <clears throat> Let's try that one again. I think I approached it on the deep end. Alright, here we go. Yep. Saved itself. First scratch always hurts the most, right? And pause. Lack of articulation on this one is definitely a hindrance, but I can definitely see, you know, it being a hard body that it definitely is top heavy, but everything is easily addressed. Got it, got it, got it. There we go. Let's give her a tiny bump. Oop. Almost drove off the other side. I broke the truck. Save it, save it, save it. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> Oh. 
my initial impressions of this rig. On the looks of it and the scale part of it, it's a 10 out of 10 for sure. Axial definitely got it, got it just about right with the look of the driver, all the accessories, the body, you know, all the details are pretty much on point. Performance wise, you know, it's an SCX24, so it's pretty damn capable as is. The hard body definitely is something that is going to take a little bit of time to learning how to drive it. So, you know, from the performance standpoint, I'll give it like a 6 out of 10. Just because the factory tuning on these springs are so damn stiff. It doesn't want to flex as well as like when I got my Betty. You know, that thing flexed pretty well. And of course, you know, it being a lighter, low, lower profile body, it didn't flip nearly as much as this one did. But, you know, once we mod it out and do all the things that I like to do to these things, it should be a world of difference as far as its performance. Even here on my little, my little rock course that I have in my front yard. So, uh... Hopefully you all enjoy the video, so <clears throat> you have to forgive me, my allergies have been killing me these past couple days. We had a bad windstorm these last two days, so all the dust and pollen that I've been inhaling from working in people's yards definitely has taken a toll on me today, so <laughs> forgive me for that. But uh, awesome, awesome, and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Have a good one.